In this video, we're going to be going over SAT style questions for complex numbers. For number one, we're going to find the difference between 7 plus 3i and 4 minus i. First, we need to distribute the negative sign to the right side of the parentheses. That's going to give us 7 plus 3i minus 4 plus i. Next, we need to combine like terms. 7 and negative 4 go together. 7 minus 4 gives us 3. And then 3i and i also go together. 3i plus i is going to give us 4i. And that's all that we need to do for number 1. For number 2, we're going to simplify the fraction of complex numbers 3 minus 5i and 8 plus 2i. The way that we simplify this fraction is we have to multiply the top and the bottom by the conjugate of the bottom. That's the same terms, but the sign in the middle has to be different. That means that we're going to multiply the top and bottom by 8 minus 2i. In the denominator, we have 8 plus 2i. So to find the conjugate, all we have to do is change the sign in the middle, making it 8 minus 2i. Next, we have to FOIL the top and the bottom. For the top, first we have 3 times 8, which is 24. 3 times negative 2i is negative 6i. Negative 5i times 8 is going to be negative 40i. Negative 5i times negative 2i is going to be plus 10i squared. And we're going to divide this by foiling the bottom. 8 times 8 is 64. 8 times negative 2i is negative 16i. 2i times 8 is positive 16i. And then 2i times negative 2i is minus 4i squared. Next, we're going to combine like terms. On the top, we can combine the two i's in the middle. That's going to give us 24 minus 46i. And then i squared turns into negative 1. So here we're going to have 10 times negative 1, which is going to give us negative 10. And then we're going to divide this. We're going to do the same thing in the bottom. Negative 16i plus 16i. Those two terms cancel. And we're going to be left with 64. Negative 4 times negative 1 is going to be plus 4. Next, we're going to combine like terms again. 24 minus 10 is going to be 14, and then minus 46i divided by 64 plus 4 is 68. Next, we need to separate the fraction so that we have 14 over 68 minus 46 over 68i. And then the last step will be to simplify each of these fractions. We can divide all these numbers by 2, and we're going to end up with 7 over 34 minus 23 over 34i. If you learned something new in this video, please make sure to smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, and if you're looking for high quality one-on-one -on -one tutoring, check out the link in the description. I'll see you in the next one.